Good day, I greet you in the wonderful name of Jesus Christ, King of Kings and the Lord of Lords, the builder of the church. He said in his word, I will build my church and the gates of hell shall not prevail against it. I'm Pastor Fricky Spies, the senior pastor of El Shama Ministries International, uh, Johannesburg, South Africa. And apart being a pastor for the past 16 years, I'm also uh, involved and have passion for evangelism, planting of churches and um, construction of church buildings in South Africa and also in the continent of Africa, uh, speci specifically in rural areas you know, where the people are in great need. The City of Refuge, a non-profit company, uh, is the instrument I'm using for the construction of the churches. I am the CEO of uh, the City of Refuge and uh, the funding goes through for the building of churches goes through uh, the City of Refuge and uh, we, we're also doing our evangelism through this non-profit company. I know Pastor André van Sale for approximately 30 years. I know him as a man with passion and vision for Africa, South Africa, evangelism, planting and building of churches. And uh, he approached me, he contacted me a month or two ago and asked me whether I'm still involved in the building of construction of churches and planting of churches and evangelism in Africa. And yes, I said yes, I'm still doing it for the glory of God. And uh, then he asked me whether I know of places uh, in need for a church building. I said yes, I can either identify a specific at this stage two places. Uh, the one is in Mafeteng in the country of Lesotho. And the other church building for a town in the Eastern Free State Province of South Africa, namely Weppener. Uh, the local pastor of these two places is a wonderful man of God with the name of uh, Pastor Johan Meiren of Touch Me Lord Ministries. He's doing an amazing work for God in uh, the area between the poorest of the poor in Lesotho and in South Africa. Uh, you can see the video clip of him herewith, where he will tell, him, tell you more about himself. The need for two churches in that area is very great. He's, he's presently in a tent, small tent. Uh, in the winter it's very cold there, up to minus 11 degrees Celsius. During summer months, it's very hot, up to 38 degrees Celsius, and he's really battling without a proper building or two buildings for the church, in one in Mafeteng, Lesotho, and the other one in Wepener, the Free State province of South Africa. Uh, we also work with Judea Harvest Evangelism Organization in South Africa, that is involved in uh, church plantings and evangelism and church, the building of church uh, churches in Africa. They're doing a very great work for God, and I'm also connected with them. We have already built a couple of churches through them with their help. And uh, yes, a normal snap church, what we call, we call build this church in a matter of three weeks. A snap church uh, by Judea Harvest is costing approximately 400,000 uh, South African rand. That is approximately 26,600 US dollars at 15 rand uh, per US dollar. Of which I, uh, of the city of refuge, must contribute the amount of 6,600 uh, US dollars at 15 rand a US dollar. 
that is approximately 100,000 South African rands. We need this money to, uh, to immediately start with a building project in Mafeteng Lesotho, as the project has already been um, approved by uh, Judea Harvest and they're just waiting for us for financing finances from our side so that we can start with the building project. I, in my personal capacity, uh, is supervising these building projects on behalf of the City of Refuge and I'm also assisting uh, Judea Harvest with the building program. Everything is above board. We have our bank accounts and uh, we, are, we report to the revenue services of South Africa. So everything is above board and uh, yearly, annually, uh, they, they do an audit of the City of Refuge so that everything is really above board. And your investment in this, these projects will be highly appreciated it is a great need at this stage and we really approach you for uh, through Pastor Andre van Sale for um, a contribution towards the cost for the building or the construction of these two churches. May God rich, richly bless you while you uh, think and pray about this worthy cause and uh, if possible make a donation. May God richly bless you for that. Amen and amen. Hi everyone, greeting you in the wonderful name of the Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I am Pastor Johan Meiren that or originates from South Africa. I'm living in Weppene, South Africa, but I have a church here in the wonderful, beautiful country of the Kingdom of Lesotho. Right here, I am in Lesotho now. This is uh, called Van Royen Village. It's a village inside of Lesotho where I uh, open a church uh, around uh, 2012, 13. Open a church around here, and uh, I saw the need that there are to have a church here because there are no churches in this village, just none. We are the only church, but we are meeting here in the open space here behind us. Actually, this open space you see here is where we are meeting on a on a Sunday. We don't have a building where we can come on a Sunday and have church. So many times when it's raining, the rain falls upon us. Sometimes it's cold for the old people. Sometimes in summer, it's very warm. The sun is burning us from on top. And it's very warm. So we don't have a building. We just meet in the open air here. And we don't have a church building. And we struggle. We, we, we have church here in the open. So we really want to ask you, please help us to put up a church building here. We really need a church building here in this village in the Sutu. There's a lot of children we are feeding here, orphans that we are taking care of. We are feeding them and providing for them. All people that we are providing medicine from and a lot of other projects we are doing in Lesotho. But we need a building. So please help us to put up a building here in Lesotho. Uh, donate, help us, support us. They are the relevant people you can talk to, to send your donation to to make sure we put up a building here. The building will serve for so many purposes. It will be a multi-purpose center. During the week, we will do training, skills development. We'll do workshops. Uh, we will we'll use it for home sales, Bible studies. We'll use it for the feeding center where kids will eat every day and where we can train children and help them with their homework. Also, it will be used for church on Sunday and then conferences. So please, will you help us to build a church here in the Kingdom Country of Lesotho in this beautiful village called Van Royen Village, in this beautiful open site. We got a we got a hundred meter by hundred meter property that we bought here. It's on the name of Touch Me Lord Ministries Lesotho. And we want to build a church here that can serve as a fountain of life and as an anchor of hope. And it can serve as a center to provide so many meals for people. Will you please help us? I'm in ministry now for the last 18 years. I'm a pastor. I'm the CEO of Touch Me Lord Ministry. I'm a pastor in South Africa and the endless Sutu. And I also do the community development for 18 years of my life and projects. I'm running projects all over the country of Lesotho and with the parliament of Lesotho. So I'm well known in this country, but um, I really need a building here, a church building. Will you please help me? 
And I know you will invest in good ground. I know that God will give you a great harvest if you help us. So please consider to donate financially and help us building a nice church here that serves them as a multi-purpose center during the week and a church on Sunday. So please, the church is the hope of the world. We know we are the salt of the earth and the light of the world. And putting up a property here will serve as a fountain of life to multitudes of about 7,000 people living in this village. Please, we are going to drill for water here. We are going to start vegetable projects and give hope and bring in employment to a lot of people so please will you help us i know you will and may god bless you please come in contact with us and let us know uh, what is happening and how you can help and support us and god will bless you for that greeting you then from this beautiful country kingdom country of lesotho god bless you so much thank you and bye-bye